everyone welcome to my youtube channel i am paris anija a digital fashion illustrator i'm bringing you a series of episodes in this episodes i will be teaching you how to do a digital illustration from b6 okay and in this complete series i will be having four to five episodes like from first episode we will be learning how to do a uh, basic draping and second i will be teaching you shading part then uh, embroidery a little bit about patterns so a complete package is there so you can go through the episodes you will be learning a lot of things if you don't episodes. know anything about digital illustration i hope these episodes will help you out if you like this episode to follow all the episodes and we if you don't know how to do even the basic tools and if you want to learn the detail part wait till the last episode you will have a surprise in the end okay let's get started we are learning. starting with the first episode this is the first part of this one hi everyone i'm paris so i will be teaching you digital fashion illustration in photoshop uh, so basically why we are using photoshop software uh, so basically photoshop software is quite good for doing illustration like you can make a realistic illustrations here or you can make the quick draping effects patterns so different kind of stuff can be done so easily and quickly okay so that's why we use mostly photoshop for doing our basic fashion illustration so these are the few examples which i did earlier okay so i will be teaching you how to do digital fashion illustration and this course this free course is for absolute beginners okay i will be teaching few basic parts like from draping and few textures and different things out there okay so first of all i am opening a basic template and i will be draping a garment over it so this template i have downloaded from pinterest a basic friend template So you can work on this template. Let me show you okay, how we can work on this. So currently this interface is a white. So you can change from here if you want to change from change your interface. Like you can convert to white, grey, or black. Whatever you feel is comfortable with you, you can just go ahead. Okay. And next thing uh, here is we will be learning this tree part. So I am using a paint tool from here. And using a pen tool, I will be draping my gown. I always start my garment using a neckline only. like this way Okay, I'm just showing my design over here as well. like this way wherever i am finding a space out here and dripping in that style okay. 
Oops. And before moving forward, I'm just managing my design a little bit with the pen tool only. If you want to readjust anything, you can adjust from here. Because sometimes you make a design and then you feel like you want to do adjustment. So in the digital way, you have an advantage, like you can do adjustment later on as well, like, like hand illustration. You don't need to make a new design again. You can just adjust the design afterwards as well. Like this way. I will be moving now to make my own complete design. And we can adjust it later on as well, like this way. Similarly, I'm just working on my design afterwards. Okay, anytime you can zoom and do it, okay. In this way, you have a zoom in thing. You can zoom and do it quickly. If you want to zoom in here. Like this way. I'm just giving my another design here. I'm just doing it here like this way. Hmm. Like this way. This is how I just made this part of the thing. Okay, so over the template, we are just making a basic drape out here. Now, if I want to work over the different parts, like if I want to do a basic gloves here, so I can just do it. Okay, and if I want any detailing here, so I can just make it here.
like this and if I want more detailing I can just work on this detailing part okay now I will be working on the bottom part here okay how we can work on the bottom okay so like this way Or we can just go up and set up our crouch level and then we can work like this way and then I will move forward okay according to whatever design you're making you can adjust the lines accordingly like the side as well okay now i will be quickly working on my design and will making the panels for the design Like this way.
I can just play with the stripes here. And if I don't like anything, I can just readjust. Okay, this is very fun in this uh, digital illustration, which I like. We can adjust it anytime we want. Okay. Like this way, I yeah, was working like this. Yeah. This is how we can uh, make a basic draping. So, this is a process to work on the basic draping. This is a part one of this. Uh, demo class so you can see the free uh, digital fashion illustration workshop for the students okay this is uh, the basic draping how we can do it with the basic tools there and i hope you like this video if you like it give a thumbs up and do share with your friends and if you want the private classes and if you want to join this workshop to learn from details so you can check out the links below and if you try out from learning from this video if you try out something so do share on instagram use your use your hashtag as well learn with power so you can tag me as well in your work and this is the first part so i'm coming up with the more parts of this series okay so this is a complete series do let me know what you want in the next videos and if any query you can drop down and the next module will be of the shading how we can do a shading on this i hope you like this video do hit the subscribe button for the future updates.